Do not provoke others and so be safe from others. Violence breeds violence and peace breeds peace. This is the simplest and the best formula in life. The white tiger has a reputation of being a large, powerful, carnivorous animal. But one such white tiger called Vijay, a resident of the Delhi Zoo, had always known to be a gentle animal and according to the zoo officials, had never been seen to be aggressive. However, on September 23, 2014, a group of boys went right up to the tiger enclosure and started acting in a rowdy manner and throwing stones at it. One of the boys even jumped over the iron railing and entered the tiger's enclosure. The tiger remained motionless watching the boy in silence for a full 15 minutes. Then it pounced on the youth and killed him. It then dropped his dead body at the far end of its enclosure. What almost certainly provoked the tiger into attacking the boy was that the onlookers kept trying to divert its attention by pelting it with stones. This incident is not only the story of a tiger, but it's rather the story of life. The tiger, or any animal for that matter, is not innately aggressive. Animal attacks only when provoked or when they sense danger. Even when the animal is provoked, it attacks not out of anger, but as a matter of self-defense. So long it doesn't feel any kind of threat, it remains indifferent to whatever is happening around it. The same is true of humans. A human being is also an animal, that he possesses all those traits natural to animals. Man too does not attack merely for the sake of attacking. When a person hits out another, they do so in self-defense. If the person is not provoked, he remains unruffled. Therefore, if you're in earnest about saving yourself from the violence of others, follow this principle. Provoke no one, no one at all. Refrain from hurting anyone's ego. One who adheres to this principle will not have to complain of violence from others. Violence breeds violence and peace breeds peace. This is the simplest and best formula in life.